Hey, good afternoon, everybody. This is Kevin Ray with Resident Realty here in Aurora, Colorado. And, uh, you know, being an agent, um, I have my certain my views on things, but I understand that a lot of people uh, do want to try to sell their house themselves without a real estate agent or a realtor representing them. I can understand that and I can respect that. So um, with that in mind, I'm going to share a few tips with, uh, with you guys. So if you find yourself in that position, um, you know, pay attention and, uh, you know, hopefully maybe these tips will be useful for you and hopefully it'll help you get where, get you where you need to be. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Hey, okay. Uh, so anyways, tips for selling your house yourself. Uh, this will be tip number one. And one of the biggest things I think is, um, is photos. Uh, one thing I see with uh, for sale by owners or what we call Fizbos um, is you don't have enough pictures. You think, you know, Zillow's there for you. You're going to, you know, Zillow's going to sell your house for you. Um, really, it's all about presentation when you're uh, when you're marketing a property. So um, and uh, so one of the biggest things is photographs. Um, so look at you know look at other look at other listings um, you know in in your area or just anywhere on Zillow and uh, pay attention to what uh, you know to what they what they do and you'll see good ones and you'll see bad ones pay attention to the good ones they'll be very obvious um, so pictures one thing I see is um, not enough pictures uh, for on for sale by owners I can't tell really much about your house with six or eight pictures posted um, I need to see as a you know as a home shopper uh, potential buyer I need to see several views and angles of your living room several views and angles of your kitchen of your backyard of your master suite um, of your basement everything um, you know don't worry about your powder room because honestly you know what a toilet's not going to do much for me so I, I don't really need to see the toilet and that's what I see a lot of uh, a lot of odd pictures another thing to keep in mind with your pictures is if I were you I would do them all horizontal I would do them all um, landscape um, aspect with your camera and don't go back and forth don't go even if you're taking a picture of a powder room you really want to turn your camera up in portrait mode don't take the picture you don't need it um, so have all the pictures um, you know going horizontal go in the landscape and um, make sure the lighting is good um, use your if you're using you know try to use a DSLR um, if you can or a point and shoot where you can actually where you have a little higher resolution and where you can maybe spot meter the light so a lot of times you're using your phone and you point it at the you know at, at the living room when you got a bright light or Sun out shining outside well, that window is going to, you know, take over. It's going to meter off the window, so your room's going to be dark um, and a very low resolution. So, if you're using your phone, um, it's not ideal. But uh, if you're using your phone, touch touch the screen as you're uh, before you take the picture. Um, you know, touch the screen in kind of a lot a dark. You're more of a neutral. What you want to find is kind of a gray spot in the room with neutral lighting, and touch the the uh, touch the you know the the screen, and it will spot meter on that, and you'll notice the lighting change. If you are using a DSLR, hopefully, or a uh, you know or a point and shoot camera, um, and you're going to be taking a picture towards a window, actually turn it to the left and normally you just touch the you know the uh, shutter button and it will meter off of an area inside the room then turn the camera back and take the picture that'll give you a lot clearer photos um, and a lot brighter photos uh, so that your room's not so dark and nobody likes a dark house so that's maybe a reason a lot of people a lot of listings get skipped over um, just because the photos are horrible um, if you notice before you upload your photos that they're blurry go take them again please uh, blurry photos just don't do anybody any good and they'll actually do more harm than good so uh, people are are that whatever um, that uh, people will 
not come look at your house because your photos suck and uh, we find that in real estate a lot of you you have a house that the, the, you know that's been on the market for a long time quite possibly is because the pictures are bad so um, so do yourself a favor pay extra attention and take fo take extra photos um, Zillow let you upload a ton of them so um, you know upload all that they will let you or at least very close to it um, you know just so that people can get a better idea of your house um, especially if your house is really nice if it's kind of you know up, got a lot of upscale you know features got a beautiful kitchen got a nice uh, you know um, you know living room luxurious master suite make sure your photos do it justice so anyways that's Tip number one. So uh, next photo, next um, sorry, next video in the series, we'll uh, we'll be talking about some other things. Uh, we'll get into. We'll talk about video. We'll talk about several other cool things that uh, you can do to help yourself. So uh, uh, if you would uh, write down here or here somewhere. Ah, shit, I don't know. Somewhere if you're on YouTube, um, subscribe to the channel so you'll get all these uh, videos. You know, you get notifications when they come uh, when they come online. And uh, if you have any questions. Call me, call Laura. Um, my number is 720-595-5508. Email is KevinRay5280 at gmail.com. And if you would rather talk to Laura, that's fine. I can understand that. Give her a call at 720-595-4556. And uh or just or like I said just leave uh, you know leave a comment ask your question in the uh, in the comments below either on YouTube or Facebook wherever you're watching this so uh, thanks for watching guys and uh, hope that helps you um, if you are gonna sell your house yourself I um, hope that's a good uh, tip for you thanks guys bye